I specifically wore this shirt because we're gonna have a good time. I chat so much. Shh. Okay, so I thought I'd start off naked naked because um, I thought I'd swatch everything first I've got um, and then I'll go in and do an eye look and then do like the face and everything with the XX Revolution stuff that I've bought which is obviously a very exciting thing I've been waiting like well over a month for this to launch I stayed up till midnight to get it um, ordered it paper express delivery and then it got here and um, they forgot to uh, put in the box the most expensive part of my order which was the um, extravaganza palette the big old 28 pounds colorful rainbow one so I literally like I got like, I got my packages there was the boxes I was all excited I was like life's good you know life's good I can't wait let's get into this and I opened this big box I was like oh oh and then I pulled out you know all those you know they have those like netting cardboard packaging things and I was like I could see the bottom of the box and I was like there's no freaking palette freaking palette so it turns out that um i phone makeup revolution and they said oh well sometimes with large orders like yours they send them out in two different um parcels but there's only one tracking number so anyway we'll get back to you on that and um yeah there was only one parcel that they sent it in so they just forgot to put the most expensive part of my order in my box so <laughs> <sighs> anyway so this i'm not going to be able to use um an xx revolution eyeshadow palette today which sucks, um, I really wanted to. I'm sure you guys wanted to see it as well. So I'm gonna have to, um, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna do an eye look with maybe the Patricia Bright palettes, maybe the Stacey Marie ones. I wanna try to keep it revolution, but I'll just see how I get on. Other than that, let's get on to the exciting bit. We're just watching all the other stuff that I got because that's why we're here. So in my little box of goodies, I have quite, I got quite a lot of stuff, so Right, okay, what should I start off with? Well, I'll take out this first because there's a mystery, I got a mist like a free mystery box. I think it was like worth £30 or something. And um I got this jelly highlighter in that, and I, like honestly the consistency feels like does anyone remember those alien like those eggs you get and then there was like a jelly alien in it and like you could like I don't know stick them back to back and put them in the fridge to make babies and they never worked it's got that consistency and I, I'm not sure how I feel about it <laughs> but um I think it'd be nice like on the body maybe like I'm wearing a weird shirt so it's not really it's hard, you know it's hardly gonna work but yeah um I think it's too dark for me personally but yeah so you, you've got like a brush this um a palette this palette you got for, uh, for free in the mystery box as well as this revolution lipstick in the shade venture i think it's like a brown lipstick so yeah those four things you got for free anyway so i'll put those to the sides because as nice as that is for to get free stuff that's not why we're here so i'll start off with the let's do the duochrome eyeshadows like the liquid ones let's do those let me get those out oh also you get that this this unicorn palette as well for free in the mystery box thing i forgot about that one there you go two palettes lipstick a brush and a highlighter I'm gonna tell you the price as well, just in case maybe you don't know what the prices are. Um, if you're just waiting to see like what everything is. So I'll find those, the X-Charged Duochrome eyeshadows. And I do believe I got all four of the shades you can get in these. 
and these are £10 each yeah the duochrome liquid eyeshadows these are £10 each and they come in the shades excite thrill stimulate and evoke so they come in a little package like this it's really cool it's like a um pinky into purple packaging this is the shade evoke and then if you open it up it's actually a very small packaging but it's very sleek very nice you can see the different colors there for that one so i'll swatch this one put them on here because i was told that like when it comes to duochrome if you put them on like a curve then you can kind of see the duochromeness easier so i'll see how that goes right so this is evoke i'm going to put that there and then next to that i'm going to put thrill which is like a greeny pink shift so i'm going to put that next to the uh, evoke they are very pretty and then next to that i'm going to put stimulate which is like a bluey purpley green one and then the last one i'm gonna put next to that is excite which is a like greeny gold kind of shift which is also very pretty and it's looking very coppery off you know first first look right so let me show you guys these Right, so this one is Evoke, and this one is Thrill, and the next one Stimulate, this one is Excite. And like you can see that shift, especially this one. Right, so those are the, I'm just going to wipe those off my hand. They dry really quickly as well, so I'm really interested to see how they work on the lid. Because, like, you know, sometimes with um, like toppers and liquid eyeshadows, they can like crease and like they can dry and they can like move and come off the eye. So, that's something I want to look out for when I try these because I'm probably going to put one of these on my eyes today because I can't help myself. So, yeah, those are the four Durocomb liquid eyeshadows. So, I'll put those to the side. And then the next, I got three of the Chromatics Duochrome Pigment Pots. Um, these are £14 each. I didn't get all of them because, I mean, honestly, it's really expensive. One thing I will say is that I was shocked at the price because obviously it's meant to be drugstore and I just feel like £14, especially for how much you get, it is a really small pot um so 14 pounds for each one is a little bit sickening i got um direct rush and ignite again they're in like a little like pinky purpley box and there you go obviously with the chromatics there you go um and then yeah and then so obviously that's how big the packaging is and then i was quite shocked how small <laughs> the actual pot is because the pot is like that compared to the packaging so yeah it is quite small so i'm gonna swatch these ones i'm gonna swatch ignite i don't know if i should put a primer on first or if I should just let it look how it looks. Yeah, I think I'm gonna let it look how it looks. Right, so this is what happens when you open it. It did have a seal, but obviously I couldn't help myself yesterday. I had to have a little look. So I've taken off the seal, so you can see that it has those little holes so that the product can come through, so it doesn't just go everywhere, which is kind of a good thing, obviously. Um, yeah, so I'm just gonna dip my little finger in there. I'm just gonna swirl that around my hand i'm just gonna put them in like a little circular motion like try and get a little build up so that's ignite and i'm gonna put rush on next on my hand and again the little holes that's what it looks like so put that on my hand 
they are very sparkly very sparkly indeed like this really will add such like a pop to like even like a halo eye when you just have like a little bit in the middle this will really add a lot to a look and then the last one that i got is called direct um i tried to get a little mixture of colors because i couldn't afford like to get every single thing from it so yeah um this is like a pinky one like a pinky gold shift it looks so nice in in the pot i don't know if that's gonna pick up oh there's a lot that's come out on this one I'm scared to tip it right so i'm gonna i don't know why all of that's just like at the top right so i'm gonna put that there i've kind of made it look like a little ghost face by accident on my hand <laughs> oh well <laughs> kind of looks like a, like a bug or something anyway right so i'll come around and show you again because i've done things so awkward i can't really show you without standing up first <laughs> so this one is ignite this one is rush and this one is direct that is doing like such a nice blue shift and then that turns into a nice gold and this one kind of just stays purple i mean oh there is a little bit of pink reflect in there but these two are insane god i literally i need those on my eyes these two like this one's a little bit underwhelming it's not really doing much it's like it is nice it's pretty it goes from like a little bit of pink to a stunning like royal purple but then these two are just insane like that shift is just chef's kiss you know and yeah so those are the pigment pots um, like I said they're £14 each so they're not cheap but if you love durochrome stuff like I do I love durochrome I love iridescent stuff like oh it does things to my insides honestly I just can't get enough of it so like this is what's really drawn me to XX Revolution because unless you pay like I don't know every time I've tried to find like like um, multi-chrome or duochrome stuff it's always been quite expensive and like I can't justify paying how expensive it is as well as like shipping because a lot of them are from the US and obviously you have to pay like um, um, customs and stuff like that so to have this in that's going to be in boots and like on the revolution website is great but obviously 14 pounds I mean it depends on you know if you think it's worth it personally I do obviously i need to see how it works in the eyes but just looking at swatches the payoff is so nice and i will be probably buying the rest of them in a few months when i've recouped some money because this was a very expensive haul <laughs> we'll get the durochrome stuff out of the way first so then next we have i bought three durochrome eyeliners um because again how can i resist buying more durochrome stuff so let me have a look quickly and see how much i paid for these these are 10 pounds each um and i uh, let me have a look they do six shades um again i got three um i'm kind of annoyed at myself because where i was in such a rush because like i was terrified that like how many people were excited for the launch that, like everyone was going to rush and buy it and then it was going to be like a sellout thing like i don't know a jeffree star launch or something so i was like literally just adding stuff to my basket and going crazy like going absolutely ham with it um and i didn't really look because these two i've got um the shades atomic energy and bolt so atomic and energy look kind of similar because it's like they both got kind of like a goldy shift like this one's green goldy i think and this one's like coppery and gold and then this one is purpley i think but I'll, I'll show you anyway i'm going to be swatching atomic first but they come in it's a very thin um bottle is, that, is it a bottle <laughs> um yeah so this is what it looks like 
There you go. That is the um, applicator that you use for mine. It's quite thin and long, so I'm interested to see how that works on the eyes. It's so weird, like it's so glittery. So like when you put it on, like you can see it just like moving in the light. It's like really cool to see. Um, it is very liquid and I can see it bleeding into the cracks of my skin. So um, yeah, I'll have to see. I think maybe it, like it will does dry fairly quickly, but just be careful. I think, I think you have to be careful when you put it on your eye because like if you're doing liner or something, like you don't want to like open your eye wide straight away and then like it's just going to like transfer probably. So I'm going to do quite a large swatch of that. It's not very neat, but I'm, I'm no professional, you know what I'm saying. Right, let that dry a little bit. Um, I'm going to swatch energy next to it, I think. I'm going to swatch energy next to it just to see like how similar they look. Because I think I kind of messed up a little. Because like I really wanted like a... What's well, got one of those like ball things in them? Right, so yeah, this is um, energy. So I'm going to put this one next to that one yeah, this is more of a goldy green whereas um atomic's more of a green green you know wow my english skills yeah they are very liquid i don't think you're going to need like a lot of product when you're putting this on your eyes i think it's going to pop like just fine by itself all right so then i'm going to put um bolt next to that right i'll let this dry and then i'll show you so like i said this one is atomic this one is energy and this one is bolt this one's still a little bit wet i put way too much on so this one kind of looks like it kind of goes from my camera's making it look more bluey green but in real life it's more of like a goldy like i don't know a chameleon green is that a thing um and then this one kind of goes from a gold and it's kind of got like rose gold in it too um it's got like rose gold in it it goes this one goes from like a bright green to like a teal a teal kind of shift and this one's like rose gold into some sort of green and this one's kind of got like royal blue with royal purple and a little bit of pink they're all very pretty but they do take a little bit of time to dry so just bear that in mind So yeah, those are those three that I got. So I'm thinking today I'm probably gonna do a green look because I'm really, really digging the green. Oh, sorry about my throat. Like I'm drinking an energy drink and I can't physically burp like at all. So my throat makes these weird like frog noises. <laughs> I know it's so attractive. But anyway, if you're wondering what that is, it's gas that is just trying to come out and it just won't because my body hates me. But anyway, yeah, I'm really digging the green durochromes that the um, XX Revolution have come out with. I just think they're stunning. Like, um, like these two I do really love. Like, I'm loving this pinky purple one. Like, I do. I do love it. But, um, for the sake of today's look, I reckon I'm going to go in with the greens. I think I'm probably going to do, like, a little circular look with, like, a bit of a cut crease and some wing liner. Really get that durochrome in there really pushing the duochrome <laughs> so that is the last of the duochrome that i've got